Hey guys, get ready with me for the second day of school. Guys, I am already done with school. Like, I it's the second day and I'm already done. So I would say the majority of my classes I have friends in, but the ones that I don't, I just, ew, I got that on my lip. The ones that I don't, it's just such a struggle. Like I get, it's seriously such a struggle. Like my second hour, I have advanced chem, which is a super hard class. I don't have like anybody in there. I have like maybe two friends and I don't even sit next to them. But I am thankful that I have literally the majority of my friends like in my lunch and Coco just woke up. But anyways, we all sit together, which I'm so excited about. Also, this is my second year of high school, so I know the building like a lot better than I did last year, which last year I was so scared about because my school is massive. But I'm also glad we started on a Wednesday, so the weekend is close. So that's I'm hoping today is a little less boring than yesterday. Yesterday was just a lot of like syllabus reading, classroom rules. But like I also don't really want to start work, so I don't know. It just like gets more fun like during the year when you're kind of like in a like routine. This is like my fourth bottle of this stuff. I love it like so much. Okay, I'm going to do my mascara and then I'll be back. Okay, so my Fenty lip oil is in my backpack, so I'm just going to use it when I go downstairs, but now I have to leave. Bye, guys. Hey, guys. Get ready with me for school. Guys, it's finally Friday. I'm so happy, and my school is a uniform school, mostly, and um, they have dress down every Friday, so basically, we don't have to wear uniform every Friday. We get to wear whatever we want. Okay, I'm in my D-block era, obviously. Okay, anyways, guys, I had the like hardest time waking up this morning. And my phone was dead when I was asleep, and I didn't even know that. Thank goodness, like, my own brain or whatever woke me up at 5.45. I don't even wake up at 5.45, but I just had enough time to charge my phone and then fall back asleep for another 15 minutes. But yeah, and then when I woke up at 6, I did not want to wake up. I think I didn't get out of bed till 6.30. Anyways, guys, I'm actually starting to like my nails more. Before, I didn't like them because I wanted long almond nails. And the only reason I got these nails was because I thought I was going to do volleyball. And then I definitely did not play volleyball. Guys, I just put my SPF on and I look like so pale right now. Okay, I'm gonna use my sun drops because I love this stuff and they make me so bronze. Guys, I seriously need to go tan. I'm like, my tan lines are still there, but I just need to tan. Guys, I've been seeing so many videos on my For You page about how it's escapism season or about like waiting for escapism season because I think. Escapism is more like popular during winter. But guys, I love this song. Like the vibe this song gives me, like, I don't know. I just love it. I'm using Hourglass Concealer because I think the concealer that I was using the other day broke me out. Guys, I got so many comments asking for my playlist and I don't even have one, but I'm going to make one with all the music that I listen to because I've gotten so many. Anyways, guys, um, I keep getting like more and more tired when I wake up every day. Like, in, on Monday, I was not tired at all. And then, like, it just gradually, I just got gradually t more tired each morning. Okay, I'm gonna do brow gel. And I forgot to do it before again. Guys, I forgot to do primer. Uh, <laughs> guys, my favorite part is highlighter, always. Um, okay, I'm just gonna set now, because I just did my lashes. Oh. Okay, I'll also show you guys my outfit that I'm gonna wear for my non uniform day. This is the outfit. It's all sun. Yeah, it's super cute. And I'm gonna wear white crocs. Bye, guys.
first day of school. Ignore my skin, it's gone a bit flary up. It just does that in the morning. Um, also, I need to re-straighten my hair, that's why it's looking a bit like bouncy. No, what's the word? Bumpy. Like, it's not very straight. But today is the first day of school. Um, I'm not like, I'm excited, but like, I'm not dreading it. Like, some people are like, I don't know, like, down, like, just now. But I'm not, I'm not that bothered. But it's 20 to 9. God, I did not think it was that time. Oh my god, I just looked at it there. Okay. It's 20 to 9. I start at 9.45 because we're only in for like an hour today. An hour and a half, actually. Um, And then we start like proper classes on the Monday. So we have the weekend and then Monday is back to school like properly. Which I think will be fun. Because <laughs> I will have new teachers because loads of my teachers left um, the school. Or like they just won't teach me again because... I don't know, they just won't. Um, but loads of them will stay with me, like, does that make sense? I'm not gonna add primer, even though I want this makeup to last. It's just, last night I done a good makeup routine and it lasted for literally hours because I went out with my mum and dad, or not my mum and dad, my mum and my auntie and my cousin for dinner and it set on for like ages. Today, basically, it's just getting my timetable, learning who my tutor is, base class, locker number. That's basically it, because like, we don't really need like anything else. Oh, we're probably gonna get our diary, um, and like the stationery and stuff, because like this year, like the government gives it to us or something. Last night I used only a brush to blend in my concealer, so that's what I'm doing today. But it kind of makes my concealer crease. We're gonna use this Rare Beauty. I don't know if it's a bronzer or a contour stick. Like I just say both at this. Like I don't know. It's a bronzer stick, but like same thing. It's not really, but it's okay. I like never used to like dab it off the brush. I used to just like directly put it on my face. But last night I did this, so I'm gonna. I'm trying to remember last night's makeup routine. But I don't know. I hope my English teacher for last year is still my English teacher because she's my favorite teacher, and I actually don't know if I could do school without her. I used not the setting spray. I used the setting spray last night, and it holded my makeup for so long. So I'm just gonna spray some of that to set the base kind of in. And then I used this blush last night and I love it. It's like one of my favourite blushes now. It's from Wet n Wild and Wet n Wild is like so affordable and it's really, they're really, really good products. So it's in the shade Rosy Romance. Get a lot of questions on my brushes, but these ones are just from Fuchsia. I don't know how to pronounce it, but they were my mom's and they're like the best brushes ever. They're so good. I just used this eyebrow gel from Deals and um, it's actually the best eyebrow gel ever. I used to buy this when I was like 10, I thought I was a makeup artist, but I love the way it goes on your brows. It's just so good. I already put loads on before, I just didn't film, so that's why I'm lightly going over. But, yeah. Then we're using this, <coughs> <coughs> sorry, and um, we're just using this compact powder from Essence, just to dab down my face with the oil. People do like powder before. Um, blush but I don't know I do it after because if my blush is too pink then it like lightens down the blush as well then last night I used the wet n wild powder blush I'm gonna match it with the liquid blush then they're not the same shade but it doesn't really matter I'm gonna put a bit up on my forehead and yeah for highlighter I'm literally gonna just do it at the tip of my nose and here because I usually like put it here but I don't know I think we're just gonna do it there lightly a little bit on my chin. I don't think I'm going to do my lips till I'm dressed, but I'm using the Penny's Lip Tint in the shade... I don't know what shade this is in. Light brown and the Penny's Lip Liner in the shade Foxy Nude. So this is my lip combo. But yeah, that's my makeup for the first day of school. Bye, guys. Your best to ignore the lizard tank behind me. He's chill. Well, I want to personally apologize to anyone that I met last night because there was quite a few of you because I truly was not well. I mean, I took shots with a couple people and we had a great time. Just have major anxiety because I drank an entire double bottle of Barefoot before I even got there. Also, woke up next to a man. I literally woke up, saw the man, and I was like, oh, good. Out loud, I was like, oh, nice. And I was at my fucking friend's house, so it's like, oh my god. I was already anxious about that. And this is like my 
roommate's house so i come back to my roommate's house i'm shaking with fucking anxiety my roommate immediately was like wow you talked to everyone and their mother last night i was like i'm gonna need you to shut the hell up this island i tell you it just does something to me i've been coming to lbi new jersey since i was like actually five years old it's like the one consistent place that i have in my life i feel like because i'm so comfortable here i just black out i don't, I don't know other way to describe it i feel like my issue with the guy that i got with that we were on such a good like friendship streak we've hooked up before but i feel like we were finally at like a good friendship place i don't know why i'm saying all of this i should probably stop watch the magic of these this is the two-faced foreplay this is primer and then this is the smashbox super fan it just works so well together like so good so tonight i'm going to bird and betty so look how light my hair got i put lemon juice in it earlier i got burnt as shit today this is what i'm wearing this little top is from frankie's bikini and these are abercrombie these are super comfy pants by the way these pray that i don't do anything stupid tonight but you know i'll obviously keep you updated okay i love you guys okay bye you ready for me while i tell you guys my icks and guys starting off strong with number one is when they try to act nonchalant dreadhead but you've literally seen them care like it's so embarrassing when they care and then all of a sudden you're like also all in the span of last night i think because i did that nighttime get ready with me i got sick so you won't ever catch me doing that again next is when they are constantly talking about their ex or when they like talk bad about their ex but they are constantly talking bad about your ex like do you want her back do you want her back when they are rude and disrespectful to friends and girls sisters and mothers like that's just disgusting like what are you doing like those are the people those are the women that raised you when they are constantly telling their friends your business this one is like major gross like when they cringe at being like kept up like when they're when their hygiene is like low like that's disgusting like what do you mean mm, i don't want to work alone that's gay anyways when they try to act like they run everything like um are we alpha male like please get out of my face and you're not you're not telling me what to do when they have to tell their friends to say everything for them they'll be like their friend will be like he wanted to say this to you but i have to tell you pause for a second on that but it is finally friday and it feels like this week has taken forever yesterday i was so excited because i thought it was friday and then someone told me it was thursday and i was like the guy is constantly talking about other girls and when i mean like you can have a girl best friend i don't care about that but if you're constantly talking about said girl best friend or just like multiple other girls you can just talk to them and not me this one is definitely just personal preference or like maybe i don't know if other people do this or like have this like ick but it's when the guys are yes men to like their other guy friends what do you mean buddy boy jake can come over here and tell you to do something and you're literally like praising him on your knees saying yes i will do that my morning lips actually go so crazy like another fat one is when they tell you like they hate when you wear makeup not even like guys who just say like oh you look so much better without makeup like that's a compliment like thanks but no when they're like constantly telling you like oh i hate makeup oh i hate when girls wear that i'm gonna do my mascara and then i'm gonna do my powder products and then i'll be back also another like this is, this is my last this is my last one but it's when they're like major mama's boy and you're constantly telling their mom everything and then they like get their mom to gang up on you when you do something wrong lips that's all bye friends hey guys get ready me today i'm going out into town for food um, to celebrate, well not really celebrate, but to be proud of doing my GCSEs. Um, <laughs> I failed everything. Honestly though, I was, I knew I was going to fail maths. Um, I failed English literature, I failed geography, I failed science. But I passed English language, so I'd have to reset my English. So basically, I only have to reset maths. So it's not that bad. I just know my skin's gonna break out, so because I'm coming on that time of the month, I'm changing contraception, so that's gonna be fun. So for anybody that knows me, good luck, because you're gonna get an angry little girl, and I probably am already angry because last night I cried for three hours straight, and poor Finn had to deal with that, but it's fine. But well done to every girl and boy that went to go get the GCSE results. And if you didn't get what you wanted, just remember, it's a piece of fucking paper. It doesn't mean shit. It generally doesn't mean shit. So just ignore it and move on in life because you're always going to get somewhere with your personality and not what's on a piece of fucking paper. But anyway, Leeds Fest. I'm going on Sunday, so see any of you guys there if you're there. Um, I'm actually excited, you know, for it. Like, I'm generally really excited. 
um but my outfit came today and it's way too much for leeds fest i will also freeze so now i've just ordered something after a little thing which is coming tomorrow um it's, it's literally the shittest outfit ever but if i'm gonna be warm then i don't give a fuck um i'm going to college tomorrow to give them my gcse results and find out my timetable but hopefully because i've passed english i'll only have to go into college three times a week because my mate failed English and maths so she has to go in four times a week so I'm actually hoping I only have to go in um three times and I hope that I'm not there on a Thursday because um I want to work on a Thursday and I work on a Thursday already and I want to carry on working on a Thursday I need to get better lighting in here because what is this and what is this spot on my forehead as well it's one of them underskin spots so it just looks like a horn Looks like I've got a unicorn horn on the side of my head. But anyway, um, I did cry when I found out my results because I was like, what the fuck? I knew I was going to fail, but I was like, I was still like, what the fuck? Um, and like, all my mates passed, which is also another probably part of it. But anyway, your GCSEs don't define who you are as a person. But anyway, I don't really want to work for anybody anyway because I just don't like working for people, end of um so i want to make my own business i'm doing a makeup course and also guys um i'll go follow my makeup instagram account i'll put it in the caption please go please go give it a follow and also follow my actual instagram which is in my bio um why are you doing that guys i really want to start doing more tiktoks but i don't know what to do like the only thing i can do is get ready with me's because i don't actually go anywhere I'm going to be doing get ready me for college and I'm going to be doing makeup videos as well because that's what I'm going to be doing in college. Guys, I am ready and I'm going for Anandos. Okay, first day of freshman year is officially over so I'm going to give you guys like a little overview of like how today was. Right, so we started today off and we went like they had like all the cheerleaders and football players and they were all like standing and it was like really overstimulating and gave me anxiety and it was like a red carpet and like people were taking pictures and like i was like also kind of lost at the moment so like it's really stressed once we got in we all went to the auditorium and just kind of like made friends i guess me and my friend didn't make friends we like started a five second conversation and then like that was the end of it and so after that we went to our classes and my classes were pretty nice like they weren't terrible but like i don't know like i kept getting lost and then my hair, I did heatless curls, and they could have turned out better. Like, the front pieces were, like, almost straight. They were, like, wavy. And so, like, during the day, they fell. And my hair just looked terrible. And it was just a whole thing. Like, I can't. So, tomorrow I don't have school, and then I have school on Thursday. I made some friends, but at lunch I was, like, really left out. What the fuck? Mm. But, yeah, I really like my high school, so it's going to be, like, a good four years. Also, PR packaging. I got a PR package and I was gonna wait for all my like packages to arrive, but like I'm too impatient. So let's take a break from skincare and unbox this PR package. So it is from Amaxi, I think that's how you say it, that brand right there. They were super kind and sent me their lightweight nourishing hair oil and it's like a repairing hair oil, which like I low key need. Do you guys like see these split ends, like damaged hair? All right, I already opened this, so, like, I know what it is, but I wanted to film it, too, so pause. I can't get this. Okay, it came in an absolute cutest bottle. They're, like, these hair capsules. Like, you open it, right, and it smells super good. Like, it smells like roses, and you take one of these little capsule things, and in the shower, you break it on your hand, and you put it, like, evenly distributed through your entire hair. Bro, I really want to just, like, pop one right now, but, like, I don't want to waste it. So stay posted for a video where I test this out because one will definitely be coming out soon. Anyways, back to my skincare. Also, I had somebody comment on my videos saying I'm ungrateful for all my PR. I just want to say I'm really, really grateful because I feel like I got famous or viral really, really fast. And I never want like anyone to think I'm like ungrateful for the packages. Like even if I don't show it in like on the video, which I think I do, it's mostly because I open them beforehand to like I kind of know what it is and obviously I'm super super grateful and like I love working with brands I love promoting brands like 
it's super super fun anyways tomorrow i'm going back to school shopping so i'm definitely gonna have like a haul because we don't get our supplies list until today and we literally just got it and i was actually working on homework and we have a test on friday so here's like the homework sheet it's like a get to know me like my favorite subject my least favorite subject like all that stuff and i'll just do that later probably tomorrow because i don't want to like wait too long but like i'm not gonna do it tonight for school okay yeah that's not gonna work i'm actually excited today because today is friday and that means it's basically the weekend oh yeah guys i found my wallet so basically i lost it after first period and then i wasn't able to find it until after lunch i'm pretty sure i left it in first period and then when i came back it wasn't there and i was like great someone stole it that's awesome and we have two cafeterias we have a big cafeteria and then a small cafeteria it was like on a table in the smaller cafeteria and yes i checked if it was mine don't worry and i would have never saw it if my friend wasn't next to me she's the one that pointed it out so thank gosh for her or else i want to have my wallet back uh, i'm running out of this i've had this for so long too if you were following me whenever i first got this you're a real one oh, guys i can't wait for fall i'm so excited a lot of y'all start your fall in Oct october oh my gosh august 1st and like yeah i get it we're excited for fall like, i'm excited too but for me i can't even start till september 1st because even then it's hot here like the day after my birthday is the first day of fall i want to watch gilmore girls so badly right now but i always tell myself i have to wait until september 1st once it's september 1st i am getting in that fall mode i've also got TikToks where it's like name the bible name the bible i love those i never miss those videos i always watch all of them i'm wearing my new york city shirt because i miss new york so freaking much like, I was thinking about it the other day, and I really miss it. I feel like you're making a big deal about the Huda Beauty powder changing its packaging. But honestly, I don't even care. As long as the formula stays the same, that's all I care about. I just realized I recorded all of that in 2x. No. So if my video seems weird, like, the speed of the way I talk, I'm going to slow it down. It's going to be, like, it's going to be, like, bad quality. No, because I was like, why is my video so short? That's why. Oh my gosh. I'm stupid sometimes. I think it's raining. No, if it's raining, that's actually so surprising because it hasn't rained in so long. Now just a sprinkler got busted. Oh, my eyes just want to close shut right now. I'm so tired. I'm just waking up at 7.30. <laughs> okay, I've just finished. Now I'm going ah, to show you my outfit. Okay, I'm wearing this today. We're going to pray that it's going to be cold inside. Because normally it is, but on Monday it wasn't and I was wearing sweats. So we're going to pray. We're going to pray. Okay, that's it. Bye, guys. You guys get ready with me while i give you guys a makeup tutorial also don't pay too much attention to the products that i'm using just because i obviously have a lot of makeup as you guys know so my products are constantly changing around these aren't the products that i use like every single day so starting off with primer i use the nyx plump right back primer this is one of my favorites next i go into cream bronzer and i'm going to be using the makeup by mario cream bronzer this one's in the shade light medium just put this on my cheeks i don't put any on my forehead i do kind of drag it up here okay next moving on to cream blush i have the makeup by mario blush and this one is in the shade perfect pink I really like to like blend this into my bronzer which is why i put my bronzer kind of higher too i just kind of blend it all together next going with concealer i'm gonna be using the Too faced born this way concealer this one's in the shade light beige sometimes if i want like a really matte look then i'll put some on my forehead and chin i'm actually gonna put some on my forehead and i do kind of blend my concealer upwards like that and then i do also drag it down here okay next i go in with powder so i'm gonna be using the huda beauty powder this one's in the shade crown cake and i do have the fragrance free version before you put on powder for your under eyes make sure that uh, your under eye is smooth so i like to just go in with my beauty blender and smooth it out while looking up that's also another tip like look up and then literally right after that put on your powder and also put on your powder looking up i also put some on my forehead and chin and nose so now i basically do everything again but in powder so I use the charlotte tilbury bronzing powder I did this in the shade 2 medium i do put the tiniest bit on my forehead now powder blush again this is one of my staples this is the wonder beauty trip for two palette this is another one of my staples the rare beauty highlighter this one is in the shade exhilarate and i put some on my 
my nose and sometimes i'll also put some on my inner corner i haven't really been doing that recently and other than that i don't put it on my face anywhere other than my nose something that i have been doing recently is using this brow pomade that i got from anastasia this is in the shade medium brown i just don't feel like doing it today also because i'm just running late usually i just brush my brows and i fill it in mostly just like the ends right here after that i do brow gel so i'm just gonna do brow gel i'm gonna be using the patrick tall one this one has been what i've been using like every single day for a while now okay next for my lip combo it's so simple but i love it i use the benetton i put on quite a bit of this actually then i lightly line my lips with the nyx lip liner this one's in the shade natural and okay, now that i'm done with that i top it off with the summer friday's lip butter bomb this one's in the shade pink sugar and that's literally it it's so simple and natural but like i love how it looks now for setting spray i've been layering my setting spray so first i start off with one size setting spray this is to lock my makeup in place and i layer it off with the milani make it last original i just realized i have 10 seconds left this is the mascara combo that i do literally every day 